I took my talents outdoors again. Here's some exercises you can probably do at home. Stay tuned. Yeah, I hear bagpipes in the background. You hear that? I'm watching. The number you have dialed. Please note, the new number is. YouTubers, welcome back to my channel. It's another beautiful day out here. I decided to put myself to work. You know, when you give yourself something to do, you always have something to do. So I got to practice at my craft. I got to keep practicing, getting better at my editing skills, finding ways to improve my channel. And that's what I do. So I'm taking you out. I bought all my gear with me. I'm going to do another quadruple cam workout. So I got all my cameras and things. And I'm taking it to the soccer field. Stay tuned for this one. I got a GoPro coming in soon, so I'm going to redo this this uh, vlog, I guess. I'm going to redo this workout again. I just want to practice today. I want to practice my editing skills. I want to get better. I want to be the best editor on YouTube. I know that's a pretty high standard, but hey, the sky's the limit. I want to be known. I want to be somebody, so this is my attempt to do just that. Anyways, a workout. I got to do 100 push-ups gonna do some bear crawls we're gonna do some jumping jacks we're gonna do something else so stay tuned for that I'm gonna set up my cameras I always try to get a warm-up in at the beginning of my workouts this drops the risk of injury so it's important that you warm up so I got on my hoodie and I got on relatively warm clothes, so you get warm pretty fast. And as you can see, I'm jogging pretty slow. My knee is injured, and it's been injured for a long time. And the older you get, the worse the situation is. I think I need surgery on my right knee, but anyway, I'm going pretty slow. But I'm still getting warm. My body is getting hot and ready for resistance training. Um, just a few laps up and down the soccer field. I want to show you guys different perspectives, different views of me getting warmed up. And again, it's not a race, it's a warm up. I'm just trying to get my body warm and I'm trying to get ready for resistance training. And as, as you can see, I'm picking it up a little bit. By the way, I could run a little bit faster than this, but my knee is just uh, injured as I said already. And I'm, I just don't want to hurt it and I don't want to push myself too hard and cause any other further damage. So, okay, we're going to do some uh, bear crawls, you know. I got to bear crawl a nice little distance. So, uh, I'm going to do it with the perfect push-up too. So, keeping my wrists and my forearms engaged, you know. I'm going to deplete some energy right here. I hear bagpipes in the background. You hear that? But yeah, oh, we finna get some work in. So uh, here we go. If you really want to switch up your routine, if you really want to switch up your style of training, I highly recommend doing bear crawl. It's a full body exercise that it makes you expend a lot of energy. It gets you tired. Your shoulders got to work. Your abs have to work. Your legs have to work. You really have to give a lot of energy to bear crawls. And it's it's a pretty exhausting exercise. But me, I, I'm used to it. I, I, I've done bear crawls over the years to challenge myself in different ways. You know, you want to switch up your workout so you can be versatile so you can just make yourself better overall 
In my opinion, the perfect push-up made this a little bit harder because I had to use my wrist to stay still. Like the ground stops your momentum and it stops gravity with your hands, but you have a, a grip to uh, use your forearms to grab. So it, it makes it a little bit more challenging. I never skip leg exercises. This is no exception. I decided to do lunges. Lunges are super effective when it comes to making the quads and the glutes work. So I always try to get good leg work in. Even though I got a little knee injury and I got knee issues, I try to get in leg work like body weight exercises like lunges. This doesn't cause too much pain at all actually. And um, it's effective for making my legs work, depleting energy, and getting my legs the work that it needs, you know, to help me maintain my physique. Lunges, in my opinion, are right up there with squats. They're that important when it comes to leg exercises. It's a half squat, actually. So every time you do one lunge, you're doing a half squat. And it really makes your body work, you know. So always do lunges, start implementing this in your leg workouts. If you follow me on Facebook, you know I'm in a push-up group that requires that I do 100 push-ups per day for the month of April. So that's why I'm doing this right here because I got to get my push-ups in for today. And I like to focus on my form. Notice there's no dips in my body, no sagging in my midsection, and I'm making sure my chest is doing all of the work. I did 25 reps right here. I usually break it up into four sets, 25 reps per set until I get to 100. So it's a lot of work. I'm depleting a lot of energy. My chest is working and I'm breathing hard too. And no, you can't necessarily gain an aesthetic physique doing push-ups, but you can maintain. You can get a little stronger doing push-ups. After a while, push-ups is just an endurance thing for me. There's very little value after that. Yeah. I'm gonna keep it real with you. My jumping jacks are sloppy. It's, they're horrendous when I look at them. But um, I have a knee injury. My knee is hurting right here. I'm, I'm holding my knee trying to get through the, the jumping jacks. I just want to get some work in, but my knee is hurting. And um, I'm bracing a little bit, so. So unfortunately, due to COVID-19, I had to pack it in early. The cops came, they told me I had to leave, but as you already see, I got enough footage for this video. So, <laughs> hey, got a nice little workout in. Challenged myself, I just ran a little bit. I ain't run in a long time. A little cardio, and of course, my resistance training. I hope you liked the video. Don't forget to like, don't forget to comment. Let me know if you wanna see more videos like this in the future. When all this COVID-19 stuff blow over, probably come outside a little bit more and start dropping footage like this. Yeah, got a lot of work in. Still working. I gotta walk back home about two miles, so uh, a lot of work to do. But yeah, like the video, share the video, comment. Let me know what you wanna see in my upcoming video. Of course, you know I stay in the gym when the gym get back open. So looking forward to that. But uh, yeah, and as always, thanks for watching. I'm gonna see you in the next video.
hey before you go don't forget to subscribe to my channel check out a few of my other videos for fitness and nutrition see you next time